Access to raw materials is essential for the European Union to realise its digital and green transition. And demand for these materials is projected to rise significantly in the coming decades. To emphasise their importance, the EU has declared some of the materials as critical because they are indispensable to the economy, face high supply risks due to being mined in just a handful of countries outside the EU, and are vulnerable to rising geopolitical tensions and competition for resources. But the good news is there is another way to source some of these materials. They are already contained in the urban mine. That means in the objects we use and dispose of every day, as well as in construction materials and in residues produced by the way we live. The EU is focusing on the urban mine to help safeguard its critical raw material supply and is boosting efforts to collect and recycle waste that is rich in these materials from within its own borders. But there is a significant barrier. The lack of a complete understanding of which critical raw materials and in what quantity these items contain. The Futuram project aims to fill this gap by developing a knowledge base on secondary raw materials in Europe, including forecasts to 2050. Futuram will identify the amount of these vital materials currently in use and in the waste stream and model the potential for their recovery. The project focuses on the six waste streams – batteries, electronics, vehicles, slags and ashes, construction and demolition, and waste from historical mining. Each of these represents a potential and important source of critical raw materials. However, knowledge alone won't solve this problem. Facilities must be established to convert this waste into useful raw materials to meet the increase in demand. To help facilitate this, Futuram will integrate the data it generates with the methodology from the United Nations Framework Classification for Resources that is currently used to assess the viability of primary raw material extraction projects. It considers economic, technological, geopolitical, regulatory, social and environmental factors and Futuram will adapt it for use in secondary raw material projects, testing it in 19 case studies. The results of the project will provide invaluable support to policymakers and governmental authorities in this crucial area, as well as having the potential to promote the recovery of critical raw materials. Ultimately, the success of Futuram will help to ensure a more reliable supply of critical raw materials and support the EU in achieving its green agenda.